Hey everyone, welcome back to another exciting episode of Earthbound. Last time we uh, got into the maze guy, the dungeon man, and uh, had a few frustrating moments. And uh, I think we're ready to take the dungeon on. Keep this board in mind. Okay. Anyway, uh, we're gonna finish this dungeon, hopefully. Uh. Your first goal is to reach the four ropes. Place an item at the dead end. You are free to take it whenever you want. What? Molokheha soup. I don't think I've ever gotten that item before. It's a summer vegetable from a scaraba. It is high in nutrients. It is a light flavor that scarabins love. If you drink this, you'll recover about 80 HP. Okay. That's all you had to say. I didn't need your life story. By the way, the music terrible. Like, what's wrong with the music here? You have a long way to go. Getting some rest and relaxation may save you. Thank you. I like how they put the plant next to it. I really hate. Not just the music here. Well, you explore the dungeon. Why don't you make a pit stop? I wonder why I'm in this restroom right now. Oh. No, I can't use the restroom. Someone's in there. Someone's always in the restroom. Cup of life noodles. Aw, oh, man. Oh, no. I definitely want that. What is not as good as cup? Oh, I forgot. We don't have who. Hold on. Uh, let's just try. Because who's not here? And cup of life noodles is much more important than a bottle of water that we can't even use. But right, the music here sucks. The just the whole I hate this place right now. Once the dungeon's built, I don't know why I continue to read his billboards or his little thingies. thingies. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you're not wrong. This is like dungeon design 101. Is that what you're? A snake inside. I don't want the snake anyway. It's a stupid item. Oops. Don't be a slacker. If you work hard, you'll get good stuff. And I couldn't agree more with the opinion. <laughs> uh, let's see what's in this. There's a super plush bear inside. Dang it! Oh, here we go again. Get rid of the picnic lunch. Hello, Mr. Teddy Bear. Oh, uh, we didn't want the snake because the snake's a stupid item. We got the disappointing five dollars here. I built a bulletin board without a message. Okay, we've reached the four ropes. The grass is always greener on the other rope. I wonder why that is, okay? The grass is always... I Okay, they all say the same thing. Let's go the first one. Because that's what you do. 
And apparently it was the wrong decision. Rope number two. I mean, we don't need it. I'm going to touch it anyway. Learn from your mistakes. Follow this and you're bound to be successful in Earthbound. <laughs> I love how they reference themselves. I have a feeling... I'm going to skip. I have a feeling the third one's the right place to go. I knew it. For some reason, it, it would be something I would do. Make the first two duds, and then make the third one be the right one, because everyone's going to skip the third one and go, like, go straight to the fourth one, because everyone thinks that the third one's also going to be fake. I, I, I would totally do that. This is the second floor of my body, Rick Road. Some of these signs are completely unnecessary. What, the dungeon? That's an, my eternal question. I can't stop reading them though. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Let's go this way first. Guess if we have to fight them, we have to fight them. There's a hole down below. You don't have to worry about this for now. Okay. Well, looks like we're fighting this guy. The lesser mook. I don't remember what to do with these guys. I'm gonna bash it to start off. Vulnerable to fire, open to hypnosis. Okay, fire and hypnosis is what we will be doing to you. I think he's almost dead anyway. He should be, right? He should be. Um, why not? Yeah, see? I don't think I'm going to be wasting a lot of PP on these guys. Because I think a lot of these guys are already a lot lower level than me. Ten dollars. I put a bulletin board, was probably unnecessary. All your bulletin boards are unnecessary, sir. Okay, well we've been up here. It's time to go back down. If you are standing right around my belly button, oh, you are standing right around my belly button. It's a weird thing to. There's an item at the dead end, but I've been known to be wrong occasionally. Oh, this music is one of my greatest accomplishments, is it really? Because it's pretty much the worst thing I've ever heard in my life. It's like bad on purpose, you know? <clears throat> A pizza. Th these are items that I wouldn't get on my own anymore. These are awful items. Sudden Guts Pill. I don't want that either. I've never used Sudden Guts Pills. Now this I want. And in fact, I think I have a Sudden Guts Pill that I'm going to get rid of. I swear I never sneeze. I haven't sneezed all day. And I sneeze now that I'm doing this. And it's happened the last few days I've done this. 
really weird. Oh, the ducks. Mad duck. <laughs> It'd be a nice pet if they stay far away. I don't know why you would want a duck pet. Anyway. This is like the zoo. The zoo level. Oh, the slimes, I remember them. Slimy little pal. He has a bad habit of burping. I don't know if I'm ready to go up there yet, if that is the way. <laughs> he was right. There is a sign that says that. Is that... That is ridiculous. Welcome. Long time no see. Mr. Jeff, we met in the winters a long time ago. I'm Break Road. I'll grant a note's finally made me Dungeon Man. If you want, I'll come with you guys for a while. The return hole is over there. Jump in that hole and walk out. Turned himself. Jump in with all your courage. He turned himself into a giant dungeon. So I can't go in there. Goodbye, exit. Someday we should enter with courage. Someday. IQ capsule. Now that I want. So again, we'll get rid of the sudden guts pill. And we're gonna give that to Jeff, like right now, right now. Use on Jeffrey. Clip, 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 clip. Which way's out? I don't remember. I think it's this way. Hey! Look at him, he's coming with us. Does this mean he's gonna fight with us? the super flush bear guys come on like you went up by four very nice Um, how about I do this really quickly? I love that the teddy bear is with us. Hello, Mr. Teddy Bear. Leave me alone. I hate these little guys. Thank you. 
Oh, he had a shield, did he? To go this way. Oh no! Oh, you've. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Let's not get angry. Well, that sucks to be that big and you, you know, you became a dungeon, uh, which is what he wanted to be, which is, he's a freak. But, um, it's too bad that he, uh, he's actually stuck here forever. He can't ever go anywhere else. Of all the places to become a dungeon, you had to do it where you're far away from all your friends. Which is a shame. Hello, strange man. Oops. A scary place called Deep Darkness is on the other side of the river. The monsters are very strong and you can lose your health just by wandering in the swamp. You want to cross the river, river, <laughs> river, even though you know it's a stupid idea? Well, of course. The swamp is bottomless. Even if you're swimming, you'll be dragged in. It's a different story if you have a submarine. Does that mean we need a submarine? A submarine? I believe that I have one in my old vehicle collection. Please enter. I'm gonna take a quick nap. But not before we fight every enemy in the dungeon. <sighs> well, we're about to go to sleep, so it doesn't matter. Try, uh, try spilling your hot coffee on us now, you jerk. Curse you and all your families. A cup of coffee. Guess what I don't want. That stupid cup of coffee. But I'm gonna drink it. Oh, 14 HP. You can't even sleep in peace? <clears throat> I'm not in the mood for this. Nope, to this guy, because this guy's a jerk. I hate him. a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. I can't believe that didn't kill him. Okay, now maybe we can check into the goodnight bench. Yay! get through here. Nope. Quit lagging. As we remember. I guess we go talk to him personally. 
Can we go down? Then this way. Mr. Mooks. Oh well, let's just bash. Just see, see if hungry HP center works on these guys. Eh, not that well. I mean, it worked. It's just... Smash. You don't see that that often anymore. Smash attacks. I like how they keep attacking the teddy bear. That's what the teddy bear is for. And he can't take for freeze damage. For, for, for freeze damage. I'm not sure. I am going the right way. I think I am. Man, there's too many things going on on the screen, and the game is not handling it. Oh well. There's an old submarine at the back of the dungeon. It can be used to cross the river. There's a goodbye exit over there. Take the goodbye exit. And the sign has moved, so this was not the goodbye exit. This was the return hall. Right? This is the goodbye exit. Oof. Hey, it's the one present that they said that maybe one day we'd be able to get. Yay. In fact... Increases her defense by 20. Yeah, why not? She could use it. Are you kidding me? I'm not in the mood for that nonsense. Thank you. Ridiculous. I guess we'll pay to use the phone. I wonder if that's controversial. <laughs> I don't mind. Pick up, you know, it's a dollar. A dollar to call. Uh, I guess we're gonna save. And I guess on the next episode, uh, we're gonna get in the submarine. The yellow submarine at that. And, uh, and we'll see if we can get to that deadly swamp area. Alright guys, until next time.